Hello everyone. Everybody has a good intuition, I believe, <laughs> if that's more conscious or more on the unconscious side. So you guys are asking here, are you clicking that video with a title more or less that actually, you know, there is a person that could be like everybody. I mean, that could be somebody um, just, you know, in your daily life or somebody from your family, maybe a crush or whoever right this is just about a person um just about a person doesn't matter you know in which um part of life you are participating or know each other but you constantly have a very negative or just a weird feeling towards them and um, i just w would like to see here deeper and this is a general reading so you know you can have here a lot of insights and a lot of details or just you know um, stuff that that I'm gonna say will resonate I believe but still it is a general reading and we can dive deep into any topic um, of yours and if you would like to have help in some kind of life questions or so you can always contact me yeah so uh, the the point is I just wanted to know first you know um, how is this person feeling really on the inside is that something that has to do with you that they are a little bit weird energetically and you have the feeling they are maybe not in a good mood when they see you or something like that. We just have these feelings sometimes with, with people. And uh, I just see here some hidden aggression, hidden aggression just within themselves. This is just now the first question, like, you know, this row here. I just wanted to ask... Um, how are they just feeling um, in general and not because of you? This is now not because of you. It is just because of them. Yeah. And we have here, you know, uh, this row actually. And the point is there is a hidden aggression and it has to do with family and maybe with their marriage or family. And it has to do something with children as well. Okay. It could be that they feel powerless in their family or something um could be uh, but for sure they have some hidden aggression that they cannot express here and they they are playing like a happy family life maybe and they don't feel so or their needs are not met okay so these are like personal um topics here for them issues that you that has nothing to do with you at the first yeah and then you know i i um had uh, several questions here and uh, of course then i you know i i was also asking what about them when they are thinking about you actually and um what i just found out in general so you know my style is like you know i'm asking little questions that are fitting together to have you know the bigger picture and the bigger answer the bigger picture you guys is here actually that they that you guys are not really fitting together that you are living a compromise here or something yeah so this is just their opinion that this is a compromise with you i don't know if that is a love relationship or any sort of other relationship in your social life yeah it could be also you know in your job or something this is just about any person that makes you feel weird in their presence right it could be also a friend and so um yeah and this is the problem it it feels like a compromise like um like if you guys uh, would like to live actually a different life or or you are not the right match here and i hope that this is not offending to you right so i mean i don't know for which a person you are um asking here the cards are telling us um, the truth uh, most of the time. Sometimes spirit does not want us to know everything. But the cards from my experience on for many years are, you know, showing up um, most of the time, like like 80 to, uh, to 100 per percent of truth. You know, there are also the, the risky 20 that um, that are telling just, you know, any any sort of 
untruth or just not that what we want to hear or so and uh, but this is just also because we humans um cannot grasp all the time the truth yeah so sometimes spirit is like saying okay no we we are not saying here anything to it and sometimes it's also destiny to to make an experience yeah and uh, th this is all a part of it but for me as a card reader 80 to 100 are very much uh, clicking uh, otherwise i wouldn't do this uh, these card readings um in a personal reading we can have um you know a shorter or a longer look in the cards and you can also book a um you know a complete analysis where i also uh, check out your data your human design look up your astrology um something uh, also with your numerology depending on the topic so i'm very much you know topic related um working and also in a very short time even though um we are doing doing it uh, very very um accurate okay so for that you can always write me an email my email address is there underneath and now i'm just um also you know um seeing um a, a lot of other uh, stuff here yeah it is about a compromise and um what i'm also picking up is they cannot really reach you and this is very disturbing for them they think that you have secrets somehow um and they cannot tell if these secrets are positive or negative um what's very weird for them is uh, that they cannot read you mm. and that's quite irritating for them here okay um, they feel also somehow aggressions maybe from your side that could be very, very unconscious, right? Sometimes we are just also unconscious, you guys. Okay, we can be friendly, but then, you know, um, others don't feel uh, good in our presence or whatnot. What do we have here still? Uh-huh. Yeah um what about when you so i don't know in which relationship you you are you are here okay if that's you know whoever what about when you um try to talk with them i mean i'm sorry <coughs> excuse me <laughs> i got a little cold still what about you um um you're talking with them you know in a way like um i mean listen i just feel that um, the vibes are a little bit off or so i mean i wouldn't say it like that but maybe like okay uh, maybe you can ask like hey you know um i really appreciate i would you know start with appreciation always yeah i appreciate you know our um our you know our whatever yeah wherever you are with this person our friendship let's say or um our working together here or whatnot yeah um i really appreciate it and i find it blah 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 and then i would continue like okay but you know i just feel very weird vibes here <clears throat> i have the feeling that you don't like me you know whatever yeah you know like um but also in a of course in a respectful way what would that change would that change something? And I need four cards. No. <laughs> you know, you guys, the cards are saying here that this topic is not that important. It is just not important. It is like it 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 wouldn't be better very much. I mean, the situation would just stay very low here. And this situation for most of you, and remember, it is a um, it is a general reading, right? Um, but you know, everybody's picking that here up. What what you guys find. Uh, is resonating or just resonates with you um you know i cannot you know uh, pick up everything or everybody here but you know you guys your situation is not that important the cards are saying maybe soon something better comes your way anyways this is maybe a compromise for both of you and it is like it is right and you do the best of it and maybe you guys you know are leaving also somehow the situation or they leave the situation without you doing anything very much to it you know what i mean um it would not change very much it would stay more or less the same actually um it is not very stable the situation and when you shut up i'm sorry <laughs> mm -hmm.
when you don't do anything, um, it stays a little bit negative, right? I mean, the vibes um, will be the same. You know, actually, if it's worth it for you, then a talk like this uh, would be maybe nice because it, it would make uh, the situation more harmonious. Um, it, it, it would make it more peaceful, for sure. But on the other hand, it is not the place for you anyway in the first place, right? Um, Spirit wants you to know that, you know, something better is on the horizon. And if you don't say anything, then the situation um, will change maybe or you, know, you will you will find something better or you will initiate something better for you in the long run anyways. Yeah, so it's very much up to you. So thank you so much for watching, liking, sharing and for subscribing to my channel. If you need me, <laughs> um, then uh, please write me an email. And um, yeah, I'm at home with a little cold and still, you know, we have vacations and so. So <laughs> I get, uh, you know, plenty of time and you can always have a reading with me if you want to. Have a wonderful time. Bye bye. And only the best vibes. All right. Michelle Durell.